it's really hard to focus in this heat but uh, I think I'm back with another video I just got uh, wait three inch yeah three inch uh, Bluetooth speaker with a corner that was bashed in in shipping probably I didn't do it and uh, this is supposed to be kind of advanced 5 volt in it has a USB for USB sticks a micro SD card on off button and the other buttons probably and the explanation for them which is not really interesting rechargeable battery FM radio oh it has radio true wireless stereo what it has only one speaker okay <laughs> big sound good bass yep probably we'll try it out later work with USB and micro SD yeah that's what I've been saying and here rechargeable battery micro SD FM radio wireless technology HD sound and uh, USB okay so that's about it the back side is for the blue one I don't know which one I got or this is a different language oh sorry my bad but the color is different also so yeah let's uh, open it up was this open before yeah this is probably a return with that battery but it was really cheap like five bucks read the manual eat the cable micro USB yep and here's a quite big uh, for five bucks whoa it's a nice big speaker this is kind of cool so uh, this is like 10 centimeters across like this and uh, 14 tall hmm and the depth is like eight okay Convert that to whatever you like, feet, fingers, whatever. Uh, yeah. So these are fake tweeters, I think. That's what they are supposed to be. Quality check pass. And here are the buttons. And here's the model, GTS 1817. Greek. Greek. Cheat needs whatever it is. Great chickness. I have to look that up. It doesn't say the brand on the on the box, but it says the model number here. I guess that's good enough. So yeah. Should we try to fire it up? And then let's try to take it apart. It got it's got four Phillips screws. Phillips head screws and uh, yeah let's try to power it up and it works and it's with LEDs and it's searching for Bluetooth that's interesting okay let's switch it off I just want to take it apart right now and let's see what kind of battery they put inside if it's dead or not yeah build quality is kind of good for five bucks so I don't know why it's how can it be so cheap this box feels really sturdy nothing is moving around the screws are uh, black so I can see where uh, where they are exactly in what position three are out oh <laughs> these are fast tapping screws that's uh, an interesting choice for plastic they use that for drywall mostly but uh, I use it for wood this I like intelligent uh, decisions 
Oh boy. Um, there's a screw missing here. <laughs> so about that uh, good build quality. Yeah, it's a uh, two ohm five watt. Two ohm five watt. That's kind of strange. Why? Why isn't it four? It's usually four. Yeah, it's got one LED in the front that's blinking. And uh, there's a radio antenna. Oh my lord. There's a radio antenna. This wire. And there's also places to hold it. Like uh, in the plastic casing. This is genius design. Maybe they copied someone. But I'm not mad, because usually these copies are, are like 95% there as the original. <laughs> kind of nice. So let's see what kind of battery they pushed here. Is this a standard? This seems small. What? What kind of battery is this? It's just a standard AAA, whatever A you call it. Where's my multimeter? I want my multimeter. Oh, here it is. So let's see. If it's 1.2 volts, then it's a AA battery. But it also may be a small lithium ion battery. So let's see. It's a small lithium ion battery. Look, this is the big one. And that's the small one. So that's um, 18650. And that must be a 14600. Uh, now, uh, 14500. Let's measure it. As long as we have the tape here. Yeah, it's 500. And roughly 14. Okay, so that is that's uh, like 500 milliamp hours max. Or the most expensive ones are like um, thousand, a thousand five hundred. But I doubt they put in the good ones in here because this is a cheap, uh, cheap device. So yeah, I'm kind of surprised. This is my first time I saw a battery like this. Mm, wait. I saw one in a solar lamp, but no. This is a 1.2 uh, volt standard uh, rechargeable battery. But yeah, it's roughly the same size as the AA. Kind, uh, a bit bigger. Focus. Yeah. So there you have it. It's a really nice design. And I can only fault them for this one screw missing. This may cause an issue uh, for vibrations and stuff. But yeah, I'll have to measure the capacity of this battery and uh, most likely if I keep the if I keep the if I don't return it then uh, I'm going to replace that battery with a real one because this has 5 watts. That's kind of good. You can listen to 5 watts in a medium room, even in a large room, if you place it next to you. So, yeah, 5 bucks. Or, uh, should I remove... Yeah, as long as we're here, let's remove this circuit board too. Oh, not like that, but <laughs> I'm an amateur here. Yeah, let's just remove the screws. One little screw, three little screw. One little, two little, three little Indians. No, five little, four little. Whatever little Indians. Oops, come on. 
Oh, that's kind of nice. It has these bigger uh, buttons here. Switches. These are kind of nice. And the standard chips here for charging the battery, accessing the micro SD slot, and uh, playing MP3. So, yeah, this is kind of nice. Should I get a close up of this chip? Maybe. Yeah, there you go. If you're interested, it works at 24 megahertz or gigahertz megahertz the small chip and yeah this is kind of a cool little speaker 5 watt 2 ohm and uh, all the capabilities for 4 bucks 5 bucks 